<laughs> That's what you guys do next. Go butt to butt. Robin uh, Slim Show. Not enough gay shit for one night. <laughs> it's yeah, never enough gay shit. Preston. Preston, what's going on, brother? Hey, you breaking equipment again or what? Oh, breaking hearts, Enjoy. breaking aces. I got, uh, real quick, I got something to play. Right. If I can find it, it's blah, blah, blah. It's right here. Come on, Windows 10. Everyone nice. Loves Preston nice. is taped in front of a live studio audience. Yeah, you got to send me that sound bite, dude. You want it, dude? You should have, you should have, you should have yeah. that as a ringtone. When you do comedy, that's what should play before you go yeah. on stage. <laughs> dude, that should be it. Yeah, you got to send me that sound bite. That's I, great. I will, dude. Just, yeah, definitely, definitely. We'll get that going. What's going on, brother? Uh, nothing. I was just, um... <laughs> Working and, and trying to, to not be homeless, you know, things yeah. like that. See, I try to be homeless, and I just find families to, like, squat in their house. Like, once they go out for the mail, I run in, and I just I just stay there. They can't get rid of me. Yeah, it's pretty no, awesome. you guys have had some, some actual guests in studio. I'm quite proud of you guys. We, we, we did, and we have a new intern, too, because we're uh, euthanizing Slamborghini. <laughs> <laughs> I give the cirrhosis. Who's your intern? Uh, Amanda, she won the Enter for a Day contest, which I thought you were going to enter. <laughs> There's just no way anybody would pay me money to fly out to Jersey. I mean, I we wouldn't. We wouldn't. <laughs> exactly. There's no way any of us would pay you. <laughs> we need to get like and and uh, we need to get a company to to sponsor that, like to sponsor. Like, Absolutely, you like, need more sponsors. Preston trips to New Jersey. Yeah, <laughs> Preston trips international. We we need to exchange students. We need to get on. <laughs> How do we get exchange students? That's what somebody needs to figure out. <laughs> <laughs> you, you'd probably get like German guys for exchange. That's, you wouldn't get any of the Swedish chicks. You'd that's what like, I want. Like, German guys. Yeah, that's fine. the guys that like the bare bottom spankings. Yeah, and, we, we and don't the need those Swedish chicks. Yeah, no, they got hairy armpits anyway. The German men are less hairy. That's that's how you judge it. Like it's less, it's 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 more acceptable with the less hair. <laughs> so explain to me the uh, the intern for the day. How'd that come about? I just got sick of Slambo and, and ran and ran the contest. I got contest. I got uh they had to euthanize me in a couple of weeks because I, I got cirrhosis real bad from drinking too much beer <laughs> and cancer AIDS. He's got feline AIDS. He's got feline AIDS. In, in, incurable Slambo cancer. <laughs> <laughs> it right in the center of his asshole. <laughs> and my liver, it Patient spread zero of Slamborghini <laughs> cancer. <laughs> it spread from my liver to my ass. <laughs> patient zero. <laughs> you need a T-shirt that says Patient Zero. <laughs> <laughs> and Robin Slim Show on the back. That's our new shirts. All right. you you're a genius, bro. You've definitely given us given us a new idea. That's right. I'm a marketing guy. Okay, yeah. what can I say? So. <laughs> Are you still doing a uh, sketchy comedy? I'm doing I'm doing a show tomorrow. Cool. I'm going to be at uh, Rosita's in Anthem in North North Phoenix. If anybody is listening and nearby, that's where I'll be with about uh, half a dozen other comics tomorrow, and just going to see who I can make laugh and who I can make uh, walk out. You know, things yeah. like that. That's that's how I live my life. <laughs> what um uh, have you come up with any new sketches or? Like how often do you do yeah, that? Yeah, I've got. I, I did a uh, did a new set last month at a private party. It went really, really well. Nice. So um, I'm going to see if I can tweak that a little bit. I did a I did a card trick. You know, I, it, it's not magic, but it, it's just a trick. <laughs> how does that half, work? You, get, you know, if you get half the people who are drunk and they and they they don't understand what happened, and they go, "Wow, that's really good." That's how. You yeah. Get the other, I get my the other half of the people who aren't drunk and go. Oh, I, I know exactly how you did that. And I'm like, well, shush, sh you know. Sh yeah, you, you <laughs> Why aren't you drinking, motherfucker? You definitely it's flashed a, that move you did over there. It's a two there. drink minimum. <laughs> right. Just pound right. them, bro. You'll be, you'll, you'll get the joke. You'll get the magic trick. <laughs> so the uh, the great thing is that I start out. I, I do this at the end of the set. I say, hey, I've got a magic trick for you, and you usually about two people groan like, uh, really. So I uh, stick to comedy, a, asshole. A woman, a woman in the front row, and I say, "Hey, is there anything in your in your purse that you can like, give me real quick, lipstick or something?" She hand me a lipstick, 
held up my hand, you know, showed it to the audience. I said, okay, for this trick to work properly, I need every one of you to close your eyes for about three seconds. <laughs> <laughs> so the audience just, just said, they laugh, and then I count to three, and the, the horrifying part is half the audience really did close their eyes. <laughs> So I walked it back over to the lady, handed it to her, and then told them to open their eyes, and they, they applauded. And then I, I said, okay, okay, okay. And then I pulled out this card. You pull out a card, you make him, you make him pretty much pick the card you want, because it's sticking out of the deck by about four inches. <laughs> like, here, pick any card you want, and the card's sticking out, like, right at him. And they try to pick something else, and you smack their fingers and just say, <laughs> yeah, no. Yeah. Any yeah. other card, hint, hint. It's <laughs> called forcing a card. Yeah. You're right, it's called pushing a card. So then, while they pick up the card, you kind of say, "You're not a rocket scientist, right? You know, you know, work for NASA. You know, not that you're bagging on them, but you just want to make the audience know that you know you're smarter this than them. Did this. Yeah. So then I, I take the card and I put the date on it. I write my initials on it, and I say, "You can put it anywhere back in the deck you want, but not on the bottom, not in the middle. Anywhere else you want, <laughs> you have to put it back in the deck, but not in the bottom, not in the middle." <laughs> and they look at me like like Amanda just did. Like, what? <laughs> like, and I'm pointing to the top of the deck, and they put it on top of the deck, put the card deck in my pocket, pull the deck of cards back out, and I say, okay, find the card I just wrote on, because it's got my, na my initials and, and the date. <laughs> and then they can't find the card. So I say, okay, look, if you wanted that card to go anywhere you wanted, where would you want it to go? It's got to be in this room, though. So, based on how the trick works, you pro you preposition them to look somewhere else, and then you have a person in the back of the room pick up, and sure enough, they've got the card that I wrote on yeah. just seconds early. Ah, it's I... not magic; it's just a trick. <laughs> you, know, you get enough drunk people in the room, the trick works out pretty well. Yeah. How, how do you get them to look somewhere else? You just go, "Hey, what's that?" Fire! Fire! <laughs> <laughs> just. Well, generally, you tell them, oh, it's right here, and you, you point to space <laughs> because they think they're too drunk to look at a card floating in the air. Yeah. And you say, it's right there, and it's, it's moving, and you, you point to air, like above people's heads, and they're actually looking around like, what? What, what am I missing? <laughs> Real quick, we got a video to play, uh, uh, Preston, and you can play it muted. We can keep talking because it just looks like it's more of a visual. All right, let me it's uh, it's a man on his knees making out with a midget. Matt, <laughs> Mel Matt Meller just sent it to me, so I think it's uh, I, I think it's it worth bigger? watching. <laughs> What's that? I, I'm trying to figure out this way I can make it bigger. I can open it. Yeah, messages. Spank Slambo. <laughs> did that already. No more. I've done that too much today. I did that before the show and during the show. Once is oh. more than enough. Yeah. Right. Hey, it's a man on his knees, Preston. <laughs> oh, that's, on, I gotta go back because at first, at, like the picture, it just looks wow. like a normal, it looks like two normal sized people <laughs> making out. And then no, when you doesn't. play the video. Nobody's ass is that somebody's pecs. <laughs> oh, right. good, good point. <laughs> you got me. It's a man making out with a midget on oh, his knees. hot. <laughs> and a fucking, I don't know, what is that? What is this, like, is this a, like a modeling show? Is that, like, a, is that, a, is that a nightclub? Is yeah. it a show? <laughs> I'm looking at it right now. That's some <laughs> heavy kissing, man. Oh, it is. Oh, yeah, did she, uh, where did she get those clothes? I mean, if you're not sure, where do you go get clothes? <laughs> where do you get so that slam I, I don't know. <laughs> <That's>, <laughs> the kid's slutty section. <laughs> he slapped her ass. At the Halloween <laughs> store. <laughs> the slutty kid's section. I love Frosty how he... tots are us. <laughs> awesome. Is that a cat and jack <laughs> <laughs> or an Oshkosh for gosh. <laughs> Stripper boots. Oh, that's amazing. <laughs> <laughs> they have their own slutty midget line. <laughs> but it's still, it's Oshkosh. Oshkosh for gosh. <laughs> slutty midgets. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fuck. Would you do that, Slim? Would you make out with that midget? Yeah, I would. Good. Well, I don't get any other action, so <laughs> if the bitch is going to throw herself at me, I might as well. <laughs> you can get rough with that bitch, bro. You can yeah. throw that bitch around. You can I don't know. I'm a little well, she might be busy. Around. I mean, the, the guy, on the other hand, he's probably free. You're probably better off with the guy. Yeah. He'd be way easier. Yeah, yeah I think you're right, Preston. <laughs> right up your alley, bro. <laughs> I think guys are more into me than girls anyway, so. Was there a link to his personal Facebook page in the video? <laughs> oh, or... We can set this up. <laughs> Preston, what did you do for your wife for Mother's Day? 
we I cooked your breakfast in bed. We just had a, a nice leisurely weekend here in the house. It was really nice. So, nice. Not that it was um, no slash, like no hanging out with slash. Yeah, not not this year. Um, they are coming back, you know, for another North American tour. I, I heard they they think like half a billion dollars on this tour. You should take That's her to see the Antwerp. You should take your wife to see the Antwerp. You ever see them? I have not seen them. <laughs> yeah, that'll be that'll be a surprise for both of you. <laughs> <laughs> Is it the Antwerp or die? D. It's not, okay, D. Yeah. Yeah, it's spelled die. Back in the day, what's Guar that? Was you saw Guar with Guar? your wife. Dude, I love Guar, man. They're like one of my favorites. <laughs> oh, man. Dude, I, I just pulled up your live shot. How many empty beer bottles has Slambo killed over there? Oh, my God. And he just got here. Look at this shit. And he's got to drive to uh, probation in a few minutes. <laughs> and he's driving us to probation as well. And and, and he's going to piss for us, too, like because we've done too much. <laughs> He's done less than us, shockingly. Love, it's the intern's what job What I love to about your table right now is the empty beer bottles and one giant bottle of water sitting in front of a man. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a classy-ass bitch. That's it. <laughs> I was going to say, yeah, what you don't realize is all those empty bottles were actually from Amanda. <laughs> oh, that's like the M. Night Shyamalan I was just going to say, plot twist. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, to pick on Amanda just for a second, did you walk into the store and say, I need beer bottles to match this hair color? Yes, and I said, did. And said, oh, these are right over here. I only specifically uh, touch things that are my colors. So <laughs> black, green, yeah, that's pretty much it. <laughs> That's, that's like that Slambo's so, if, if, if nobody can see your picture on TV right now, that sounds so horrifying. Only my color's black and green. It's really not really romantic for a girl. I'm just letting yeah, you know. Yeah, you win some, you lose some. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Preston, we got to wrap this up, dude. Preston? Yep. Yeah. <laughs> we got to wrap it up, bro. Guys, um, yeah, I'll be at Rosati's tomorrow. You can find me on Facebook, Preston Gunderson. Find me on Twitter at Preston Gun, and find me on Instagram at Preston Gun Comedy. Um, there's obviously two Preston Gundersons out there. I'm not the good-looking one. There's what? a real good-looking kid in Minnesota. I'm the other guy. I forgot we so, did find him. I found him. Right. He was a jerk-off. <laughs> He's from Minnesota. He has nothing better to do. <laughs> <laughs> All right, brother. Thank you so much. Hey, thanks for having me on, guys. I Anytime. Talk Preston. to you. Uh, you're, you're taking off the summer, right? Yeah, yeah, we'll take a few months off for Slambo to go to rehab. Uh, right, going. probation and rehab. Yeah, yeah. it's, it's the know, only deal. It's only plea bargain. Class. I'm not going. <laughs> the only Can't plea bargain me. he can make. <laughs> All right, guys. I love you. I'll talk to you later. All right, All brother. Right, later, Preston. All right. Bye, Amanda. Love you. Bye. Everybody loves Amanda. That's gonna be the next. That'll <laughs> next. be the next one. Everybody yeah. loves Amanda. Give me that sound bite. I will, bro. <laughs> Remind me. Okay. All right. Message me your email, bro. All right. Later. See you.